Like, we know she is dead, because the scanners did not actually pick her up. So unless she is somehow still alive... Unless she's somehow still alive. But I'm guessing she's dead. Anyway, I can get a fridge. I am loving these new additions to possible base building. Okay, anything else? Uh, can't open you. Okay, okay. I am noticing a bit of a frame rate struggling here and there. Okay. <gasps> Picture frame! Oh, yeah. We got plans for you as well, friends. Okay, let's see. Anything else? More water? Do I need that? Yes, I do. Just like that. Because I don't have a water filtration system or anything like that. And there's no coral that I can use to make bleach. Hang in there, kitty! Oh, boy. Gosh, I... Ah, I hate doing this, but... It's copper. I can get more copper. A lot easier. That's a thermos. Don't currently need a thermos, and I can make one quite easily. Alter PDA. Meeting with Sida. Oh, <laughs> you brought a friend. Spy Pangling in training. We're recording audio, is that okay? Of course. I have the photos you sent. Um... What am I looking at here? Corral pustules on the frozen leviathan. That's nothing to worry about in and of itself. It's well contained. The ice samples suggest it's been frozen since the time of the outbreak. The strain made the planet uninhabitable. If it mutates... Are you feeling unsafe? Very. Uh, if I escalate this issue for you, will you feel comfortable enough to concentrate again? I have deadlines for the snow fox and the mining bots coming up. I really need your focus on the penguins. Oh, yeah. That's a relief, actually. I was expecting more of a fight. Nothing is more important than our safety. I'll take care of it, okay? Thanks. I won't let you down. <laughs> Thanks, Sam. Keep up the good work. Yeah. But, okay. The Carabacterium was brought to 4546B by the architects, because it was a virus that was on their home planet and killed billions. They spread to other planets for research, brought it there to research the bacterium in seclusion and safety. It got out when the sea dragon attacked the research facility. In that period of time, this frozen leviathan was alive, but it got frozen with that first strain of the Kara infection. How long ago was this? Do we know that? But whatever the case may be, the Kara bacterium that we encountered a few years ago, sort of, that was quite unlike the thing possibly that it started with. A bacterium or virus or whatsoever, it starts out quite bad and then slowly mutates maybe towards a weaker version over time. Many of the fish on planet 4546b survived thanks to the sea emperor. But not enough for all of the fish. There's still a lot of life gone from these oceans. But what if a new outbreak were to surface? Does that... Honestly, seems like a very bad scenario, and there's a large flask of it. God, I don't want to drop all this copper! That takes four. Oh, God. Okay, okay. There we go. Happy. Yes, I'm happy. I hope I'm happy. I hope I'm not going to regret that. God. Did I pick up the poster? Did I pick up the poster? Hang in there. I got the poster. I'm good. I'm good. Okay, um, I think that means we got everything, though there's still this section over here. Is there more here? Do I need to dump more stuff? Fiber mesh, don't need that. I mean, happy to have it over here, maybe? Ooh, ha, I don't have the ion cube with me. Oh, God. 
Okay. Fiber mesh, don't need that. You are disinfected water. Again, don't need it. Oh, what a portal. Is it functional? Um, is there something behind there? Yes, there is. How do I get there? First aid kit. Can I get there? I... There must be another way through. Oh. Are you functional? Architect teleporter. Come on, come on. This one ain't functional. Huh. Okay, interesting. Um, data bank. Original speculation surrounding these alien structures decided that the gates may have been religious artifacts or industrial machines. Further research has indicated that these gates are, in fact, medium-range teleporters that allow for the instant movement of baryonic material across space and time. Teleportation requires the pairing of primary and secondary gates. The primary gate controls the destination and must be powered in order for materials to transfer bidirectionally. If the primary gate is not functioning, the secondary gate is rendered useless. At this time, the processes that enable this alien teleportation technology are not well understood. So the first gate is, or the primary gate is closed, which means this one is kind of useless to us. Maybe if we restore something in the future, we can get back here, but we have to find that first. And honestly, do we know how to work with this alien tech? Because even last time, it was just a case of insert green glowy cube. Hope for the best. I mean, it did work, but honestly, it kind of was a Hail Mary. So, that does mean that I have got no clue how to get to you. Like, I can't get on top of here, there. Do I have to use a spy pangolin maybe here to get all the stuff that's over there? Or maybe propulsion cannon thing? Can, can, can I make those? I do not have the tools for a propulsion cannon. Hmm. So in that case, I don't know how to get through here. Honestly, I hope. Maybe with a spy pangolin. But, yeah. We're going to have to create one of those. Return here when we have got a lot more inventory space to pick up all this stuff. But... Yeah. Whatever happened here... Oh, it will for now remain a mystery. So, uh, yeah, that means do we... I think we return back to base, store some of this stuff, then see if we can make a spy pangolin. See if we can actually work with exploring those little research corners. Then we can return here, possibly go in that direction as well, because th there was the crevice down below. I'm not capable of exploring this place any further as of right now. Because seriously, I just lack the space. And a depth module would be handy. Yeah, go ahead, fall down. Oh, come on! That's not that far! I could... I could bring the frost phases later as well. Nah, for now, I need to go back to home base. And then we'll see what we'll do. Uh, and because I want to bring one of these along with me too. Goodbye, copper. You will be missed. You will be sorely missed. And so we head home with still a lot of stuff left to explore, but honestly, I wish I could pick up more. But I really have got no choice. Ah, uh, home sweet home. With a lot of new decorating stuff, aboard, which I'm still not ready yet to do, because there... I've... What did I need to make this plasteel big... 
thing lithium i don't have a lot of lithium i would need to collect more of that in the future uh, plastic ingots two of them which means four a plastic ingots i would need four lithium how much lithium do i have four i can make one large room i don't yet feel comfortable doing that no i first need to get proper amount of resources i need to figure out that i can actually work with my seed truck and go and dive deeper get those diamonds and meanwhile there's also a lot of other stuff like for example uh, where's the altar facilities map this is where we were we have this entire section to explore and this over here what we also saw goes all the way over here I don't see a clear way to this direction. And this is where Sam was reassigned to. God, there's just so much to explore. And that cold suit, which I can't actually make because I need something called Snow Stalker fur. Oh boy. We've got quite some stuff ahead of us. But first, most importantly, store all this stuff. So, the plan as of right now... Um, the plan... First things first, what I want to do, what's been bothering me for a little bit right now, is the fact that, uh, what do I need for this? I need one piece of glass, I want this bloody window here. Thank you! That is so much better. Now I can at least look outside. Instead of constantly walking in this direction. Okay. So, uh, what the plan is right now, I want to make that spy pangolin. I want to go to Delta. Uh, can I get the map? Yeah. Make the spy pangolin, go to Delta, and get those diamonds. The diamonds can thus, as a result, be used for something along the lines of um, the enameled glass. But do I need diamonds for that? Yes, I do. I need a diamond, a lead, and glass. I can just slowly work towards that depth module, go deeper, easily, maybe find more lithium as a result so I can make more plastic ingots, because I have enough for two plastic ingots right now. If I get more plastic ingots, more lithium, I can thus start working on building more large rooms in the future. I can maybe find more sea truck fragments because this thread has been jettisoning a few of them by the looks of things into the ocean which means maybe if we dive deep enough we can find the stuff that he lost but that all starts with those diamonds and i would also like to get a laser cutter for that ice sheet that we saw but the main thing thus is that spy penguin sure at the same time we also got margaret Maida in that direction we also have got the alien distress signal in that direction but right now i just want this spy penguin and i want to get the resources that i so desperately need because this is going to help me out quite a bit which means let's make ourselves a spy penguin one wiring kit one copper wire for Deployable, I guess? Yeah. Also, Pathfinder tool, laser cutter, and the diving suit. Don't need those. Um, water purification, got that. And what else? Those two. Uh, synthetic fibers with a ruby. Haven't found those. And spiral plant clippings. Yeah, currently don't need those. But spy pangling. There we go. Without spy panglings. Scientists may have never discovered that penglings incubate their eggs in small cave burrows, often alongside thermal lily roots. Nice. I mean, if those thermal lily roots also produce the warmth, that's interesting. Uh, but meanwhile, spy paneling and remote, thank you very much. Did the spy paneling just make a noise? And also, I can unpin the recipes like this. Nice. Okay, now there was one thing I was wondering, um, where did we leave that stuff? We picked up two pustule thingies, this stuff, root pustule, contains highly reactive compounds, that's interesting, but up until now I have not yet encountered anything at all that requires that. 
And also, I haven't even found the outdoor growth bed yet, so I can't even build that stuff. There's still so much that I need in order to get started properly with the building. Like, yes, I got the horseshoe, or horseshoe shrubs. I got the fever thing plant right over here that I can build later. There's just so much. Um, let's put one large filter water over here. I also got the water purification tablet that I can try out, so... Even with just two normal disinfected waters, I should be good, because I can see if this works with snow. But, for now. Um, yeah, voice log, yay. How much space does this thing take up? Only one. And the remote. Uh, can I use that in here? <laughs> oh. How about we don't throw it? I mean, it's cute and all, but... Oh, I, I can't place it inside of here. Okay, fine. In that case, we shall bring this to Delta. Uh, do we have all the batteries in order? You work with hull integrity and not with the battery charge. But the rest is all pretty much good, so... Yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. I think like this we shall travel back to Delta Island and we search for those diamonds at least if I can remember where Delta Island was come on just a safe trip no cryptosuchus here it's in that direction I don't want to anger it so please just okay 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 just get out, get out. He's going after me, possibly, and we never went in the water. Leave my sea truck alone. Thank you. All right, let's see if we can find our diamonds. All right, so was it over here? Yes, it was. I need to pay attention to those lights. Like they really point you in the right direction. People have been here, we're no longer on a planet where no one has been in the past, or at least a long time ago. It is still a long time ago, technically, but more recently, more people have been here. Which means, Spy Penguin, come on, bring me all those delicious diamonds. I mean, they're probably delicious. Here we go. Yup. <laughs> Penguin EDD. No clue. Anyway, uh, we take the remote. There we go. How does this work? Like, we just activate? Whoa. Um, companionship level, infiltration value, units, penguinet, status online, mode explore, distance 2 meters. E to exit holds Q to self destruct. How about we don't self destruct when there are diamonds nearby? Big time. Can I? Oh god. Okay, so I need to move with the mouse keys. I... No. Oh. This is kind of weird. Like, I can move up and down with the mouse, but the rest has to be done with the keyboard. Doink. So you had space for four things in total. That's two diamonds. Do we have more diamonds? Yes, we do. Which means we can have to do this in one more trip after this. There we go. There we go. Come on. And bring these home. Bring these home. Do not self-destruct by accident. Anything like that. Hi. So that is how we look. Cool. Cool. Okay. So E to exit. There we go. And open storage. Diamonds. Nice. All right. Let's do that again. Um. <laughs> we can make noises. Yep, total infiltration. Total infiltration. <laughs> okay, is that the last diamond here? Is that all that we had? Uh, it looks like it was. Okay, five diamonds in total. Not as much as I might have been hoping for, but... It will do. It is more than we started with. And that's what matters. There we go. One more diamond. Thank you. Five in total. So. That is that. 
Do we go back instantly? Can you stop beeping, please? Do we instantly bring these back to the base? I think I might want to, because if we are going to go back towards the fire robotic site... Snow. I can try this out, because I got the water purification... Use? Large filtered water. Nice. I mean, it's kind of difficult to use because you have to first craft that water purification tablet and then find snow. But if you find it and got it on you, aren't you better off just getting yourself the filtrated water? I'm not too sure. Anyway, we got this. I think I'm going to return these back home. See if we can maybe create that laser cutter and then we return to fire robotics. And so we casually truck along with diamonds and a pretty silly song. Brilliant. All right, laser cutter. Let's see if we can make you. All right, one battery, one titanium, one crystalline sulfur, two diamonds. It's expensive, but I am still capable of building this upgrade, right? Two enamel cloth. I can do that. I can do that. Okay, first up, laser cutter. And then we'll take a look at... Oh, this dead module. Oh boy. This is really going to run me through all these diamonds. I mean, I'm spending diamonds nilly-willy. Oh, I do hope I find more in the future. Alright, here we go. That is one enameled glass. Number two. Already together with the plasteel ingots all for the glory of the depth module here we go oh boy I've only got one diamond remaining god I thought I was rich ah, fine 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 diamond goes over here for the time being ah, let's insert it in our sea truck so before you could go to 150, and now 300 meters. Nice. Now I would have loved to make... Oh, your power cell is... One of your power cells is going pretty low. Uh, I got the power cell charger. Do I need to make that? Like... Do I need a modification station thing? What did I need for those? If I wanted to make a modification station. Uh, that was some pretty important stuff too. Where are you? Beauty chip titanium. My last diamond. I mean, it could help me out with stuff like thermoblade and such. But these are all the things that I can make with the modification station right now. Because I lack any other upgrades. So that right now will be a waste. So I think I'll save my diamond. For the time being. Anyway, uh, depth module has been made. That's brilliant. I can now do what exactly? We went to Delta Island. We got the diamonds over there. I know there is a sheet of ice over here that I can cut through. Hopefully, maybe. I mean, I want to try it out and it seems like a possibility. Uh, then I want to return to Fire Robotics. I have two possible locations on this map where I can use a spy penguin. With a bit of luck. Find some good stuff. I got a lot of space in my inventory. Right. Like, two first aid kits, I got enough food, I got a spy penguin, and I got more than enough water. That should be fine, right? Yeah. I think this will work, I think this will work. Final preparations, a little bit of shrub nut stuff. Fill things up, have a good meal, while making all kinds of rather strange noises. But hey, if you really like something, I guess. Anyway, that is everything. That means, let's see what else we can get at Fire Robotics. So, let's truck along all the way back yet again. 
Although I'm not sure about how often the spy pangling will prove to be useful to us in the future, especially because we can't play with it inside of our base, the mere fact that it got us some diamonds makes it all worth the trouble.